Let's try to get that foot. Okay, there we go. Now we're gonna cinch down. Okay, so now we've got him contained. You can see he's fighting pretty good, but now I can get in here and I can release. I'm just gonna put that catch pole right on my gut. Just open that trap. You can see that foot is fine. <laughs> and he's released. He come right out of that catch pole. So he's actually standing right here under the camera. Let me see if I can't get him to... He's got no issue at all. With that foot. But there he is right there. He's completely released. You can see that foot's undamaged. He's just gonna sit there. So there it is, right there. We are arm's distance. We are literally arm's distance from this cat. He's completely free to go. He just doesn't realize it yet. So just to give you guys, there's the end of my catch pole, it's four feet. There he is. I mean, I'm, we'll touch him on his nose. So anyway, cat is completely unharmed. I'll try to shoo him away. because I wanna remake this set. Um, but yeah, I wanna remake this set and uh, we'll try to shoo him away here. Go on, bud. You're free. Now I tell you right now, if, the, if these traps were as damaging as what people says, would this cat be sitting here and let me talk? Literally. I mean, I'm, I'm right here. Look, I've got everything set up here. Like, I mean, it's... So, anyway, we'll shoo him away. All right, buddy. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. He's an angry little booger. All right, go on. Well. Square it off to a bobcat. <laughs> How about that? You are angry, aren't you, bud? You are angry. Yeah, I'm saying he's not hurt. This is what I mean. Like these guys just don't understand. They, they they don't realize they're out of the out of the set. But go on, go on. On. Well, I guess I'll remake my uh, my set here. So anyway, working on. Uh, I got a dog proof set right there, and uh, I got a pocket set right there, and we'll remake that set. There's our cat still. I want to see how long he's going to let me sit here now. All right, so there we go. There's a <laughs> We're going to reset this dog proof because I just stepped on it. All right, so I'll remake this set here. Stepped on that, that's still good to go. 
a little bit of sweet stuff we'll add to it. Just a little scent there. The old cat's just gonna sit there. <laughs> he just doesn't realize he can go. All right, so um, I've got this pocket set here. We caught a muskrat in it there uh, two days ago. And the pocket is kind of, uh, it's kind of messed up. So we're gonna take our trial here and uh, kind of make that back in order. Because the creek and the mud and everything kind of boogered it up. I'm just gonna dig that back out, and then I've actually got a uh, I got a fish here. I got a fillet crappie that uh, I'm gonna throw, throw down in there. And we'll tuck that, tuck that fish right up in that hole there where something's really gotta work to get it. Here's our, here's our trap here. And I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh, and just bed that trap right inside that little pocket there. Now, because we caught a muskrat too, uh, I'm gonna put a little sweet bait in there as well. So, that's a little, little bit of sweet bait. And uh, maybe we can entice a, uh, another muskrat to come in through here too, so. That's that, our two sets remade with the, uh, the creek. So, and like I said, this will this creek will probably drop, um, but we can just readjust. So, let me let me show you the set. There's a buddy. He's been watching me do this whole set. All right. So there's our there's our set. You can see it's cabled off there to the. Uh, to that big root there and our fish is just tucked back underneath there as best I could get it in those roots um, it's that's legal because I mean it's you know under undercover out of sight so trap is just set right there and right there is our observer so anyway I don't think he's gonna leave the problem is you can see how thick it is in here He's standing right where I need to go. So, I don't know. I may try to find a uh, another trail out of here. I would like to remake that set right there. Um, it has been quite the productive little set there for me. But that guy there is just... Are you going to go? We're losing daylight here, guy. I guess I'll gather my things up. Yeah. I would like to say this is the first time this has happened to me, but in all reality, it's not. There is, uh, <laughs> these cats, they just don't, they don't know. So, he's obviously fine. He's caught his breath and, and everything else. So, he's just, he don't know what he thinks. But, 
here you go. Less than four feet away from a, a loose cat. <laughs> So like I said, um, I'm really in the sun here. So can we get like a selfie opportunity here? Like, ah, selfie opportunity. There's a cat and it's free. <laughs> it's completely free. That's interacting with nature, Betty. Interacting with nature right there. What do you say? Ah! All right. Well, we'll come remake this set here tomorrow. I think I can come back out there and find a way out of this out of this creek. But there you go, bud. Free kitty. All right, y'all, well, if he's not gonna run off, I don't know how I'll stand it, but hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you, hope you learned something. I hope you understand that, you know, these traps are not what everybody says they are. Uh, you know, they're just, just holding these animals, obviously, right there. This guy here, he, he doesn't even, he doesn't even wanna leave. <laughs> so, I don't know what else to say. I'm gonna get out of here, let him, let him run off. Um, Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor and uh, hit that thumbs up button. Really helps. Also, if you would like to support the channel in any way, best way to do it is uh, getting some uh, some Coon Creek merch down below. That'll be linked down below through Hoosier. You can also check out the uh, the cable anchors that I have, which actually I caught on this. Uh, you can also check out the cable anchors, which I used to catch this. Um, this cat. Also, this whole kit that I'm using here, this is what I'm filming for. I'm actually filming for our Varmeter kit that I've got through Hoosier. So all this stuff is available through Hoosier, through the Varmeter uh, trapping kit. Everything you see here, minus the Bobcat, you'll have to do that on your own. Uh, we've also got my beaver drowners, you know, just a ton of stuff in the description down below. Great way to support the channel. Um, keep videos like this coming because I mean, how many people can honestly say that they get to do this in their life? You've been, you've been a good sport to the channel, bud. Good luck. I'm in the sun. I'm a bad videographer. Ah. And I stepped on the dog proof again. <laughs> I stepped on the dog proof again while the cat's right there. Oh. All right, we're gonna set this dog proof again. <laughs> All right, dog proof set again. Cat's still there, completely released. There's the trap. There's the cat. I'm out of here, y'all. <laughs> I don't know what more to say. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm out of here. There he goes, he finally took off. He finally took off. Oh, what an experience. All right, so finally got that cat to leave. He ran off up through there. Um, like I said, the set is pretty destroyed now because we've caught so much stuff. And to be quite honest, I could move it up there, but I'm curious to see how many things I can actually catch in this blown out set. Uh, more than anything, I want to document the fact that these critters are creatures of habit. So we put the set back again. There it is right there. You can see I used this log to build up the set, did a little bit of blocking. You can see how thick it is in here. The blocking is not gonna matter. That set, that trail still comes right up through here and it goes down through there. I still think you'll be able to catch stuff in here. We'll see, I don't know, but uh, time will tell. I've got a few more days down here, I'll leave this set, but that's the remake and the cat went over there somewhere.